In this video, I'm going to go over questions from RQ9. Problem number one, we want to find out the net force in box number 31. What happened in box number 31? All right, when the, someone cut the rope, the man is uh, 100 mass is 100 kilogram. 100 kilogram person is inside the elevator. And when someone cut the rope, the, we have to find the weight. The weight is mg, so m is 100 times 10. Um, so it's uh, 1000 uh, 1, newton. 1000 newton at what, did it, what direction? 100 newton to the south. When someone cut the rope, the normal force is then zero that means the that means the net force is uh, is negative 1000 and absolute value of the net force is 1000 newton so 1000 newton that's the first question now we're going to go over the second question what is the what is the acceleration so acceleration formula is acceleration of the elevator formula is me minus mc uh, multiplied by z divided by uh, total mass total mass on right. oh, this is one uh, 1150 minus mc is 1000 and uh, uh, that's multiplied by 10 acceleration due to gravity divided by 2150 and that gives you 0 0.68 meter per second square so the answer is uh, 0 0.68 now we are trying to find the tension force so to the fi to find the tension force we have to have the we have to have the on the uh, the equation so the equation would be let's see the equation um, so this is uh, this is m e m e g and this is the and this is uh, this is 1150 this is the elevator the elevator is 1150 this is acceleration downward this is f t this one is f t so um, so the equation would be f t minus m e g is equal to negative m e a so f t would be um it would be m e g minus a so m e would be 1150 g is um g is 10 uh well, we're gonna use 9.8 so 9.8 minus uh 0 0.68 0 0.68 so that would be ft would be uh 10500 newton so the answer to this question is b now let's solve the next problem how many mistake in this problem the problem is to find the total physics error uh, and the solution is tension so the tension solution as i uh, as we solved it before this is a pulley and two mass hanging on the pulley one is this one mcg and one is this one mez mez all right so this is uh, this is mcg and this is m e z and this is f t and this is also f t so this one would be so i see the mistake uh, right here right here so why why mistake okay so this one accelerating down is because this is heavier that means f t minus m e g is equal to minus m c g m e g so that means f t is equal to m e g minus g minus this this would be a this would be a so g minus g minus a but that's not what i see i see over here m e g plus a so this one has to be negative for the reason i explained right here because this is accelerating downward so there is only one mistake the other one is correct okay so let's that takes us to the question number last question and last question is this one so this one an elevator containing a man so the man elevator read uh, the scale reads man 800 newton so scale scale read reads the person 800 newton on the elevator and elevator is on constant speed so then there is no uh, acceleration would be zero net force would be zero then the person will feel same that means that means the force exacted by the man on the floor of the elevator is exactly the same as his weight this is similar to the first scenario the first scenario when uh, the first scenario you talk about so when the elevator is at constant velocity or elevator is rest 
then fg is equal to fg is equal to fn so the answer to the question is c the 800 newton thank you still if you don't understand anything shoot me an email i'll have you to bother subscribe to